with benefits like these, who wouldn't want to look 10 to 20 years younger and turn back the clock in as little as six months? But where does HGH come from? Are there any side effects? What's the best source of HGH? How can it benefit me? Human growth hormone is naturally produced by the pituitary gland, which is located in the brain behind the nose and is essential for maintaining the function of the vital organs of the body. Small amounts of HGH is released from the pituitary gland into the bloodstream. It travels through the general circulation system until the hormone attaches to receptor sites in the liver. Once HGH is in the receptors, the liver cells are stimulated to produce insulin-like growth factor, or IGF. IGF then flows through the bloodstream to receptors in nearly all tissues of the body and cause a variety of anabolic or building activities. The results? The body makes more muscle. The skin becomes thicker as all organ systems grow and improve their function. I'd like to talk to you about the physiology of the human brain. This is an actual human brain. It feels a little bit like firm modeling clay. This is the front part of the brain, or the frontal lobe, where you process cognitive thought. Your temporal lobe, where memory is processed, eyesight is processed in the back. You can see the enormous amount of vascularization that occurs here. In other words, there's a lot of veins and arteries and a lot of blood flow that goes through your brain. What I'd like to show you today is the pituitary gland, but that's on the underneath side of the brain, and I'd like to show that to you right now. As you can see, this gland right here is the pituitary gland. The pituitary gland is responsible for secreting human growth hormone. Human growth hormone is responsible for the growth of and regrowth of cells in your body. Science has proven that as we get older, we secrete less and less human growth hormone. After we reach 21 years of age, our HGH levels continuously decrease until the age of 40 when our body starts to show the effects of aging. Daily HGH secretion in the body is normally at its peak during puberty up until the age of 21. Middle-aged bodies secrete less than half the HGH of a 30-year-old, and those who are 60 and older secrete 25% of what a 21-year-old normally experiences. I'd like to compare two actual human brains for a moment. The first brain is the size of a brain you would expect to find in a normal 20 or 30-year-old person. The second brain is the size of a brain you would expect to find in a 70-year-old person. As you can see, there's about 30% shrinkage over the aging process. This is usually linked to a decrease in human growth hormone. Now I'd like to show you a human kidney. This is an actual human kidney, the size you would expect to find in a 20-year-old. This is a human kidney you'd expect to find in a 70-year-old. As you can see, there is a shrinkage that occurs over time. The important thing here is to note that with human growth hormone increases, you can actually reverse this size kidney to a healthy or youthful size kidney. This also occurs in the brain, spleen, liver, and other organs of the body as well. In a two-year study between 1994 and 1996 of more than 800 patients, medical scientists have measured the increased levels of IGF output in the blood after a controlled study of weekly injections of biosynthetic HGH. They measured a 61 percent increase in IGF and the most outstanding results were improvements in muscle strength, exercise endurance, and loss of body fat, just to name a few. 88 percent in the study reported an increase of muscle strength. 81% of the study participants reported increase in muscle size. The average person who increases HGH levels will get stronger and increase their ability to perform more intense work for a longer time. Increased HGH can result in a 14% reduction in body fat with an 8% increase in overall muscle mass. Your body will naturally burn fat and build muscles, regardless of diet and exercise. However, if you increase your exercise routine and eat a high-fiber, low-fat diet, 
you can significantly enhance the fat burning abilities of HGH. In a study at St. Thomas Hospital, growth hormone was demonstrated to improve patients' mood and was more effective at relieving depression than the drug Prozac. This increase in energy is most pronounced in people whose energy levels are low to begin with. HGH has been documented to rejuvenate the immune system by improving T-cell lymphocyte function, red blood cell production, increase antibody production, increase the activity of natural killer cells, and increase the amount of tumor necrosis factor. Human growth hormone regulates the rate of cellular division. This is a normal cell with a nucleus. It makes a copy of itself, divides into two identical clones. This is important because as a normal cell makes a copy of itself and divides into two identical clones, the process takes a short amount of time, but a cell can lay stagnant for two to four weeks. This is important because as human growth hormone decreases, the rate of cellular replication increases. In other words, a cell lays stagnant much longer, predisposing it for more cellular damage. But as you bring on an increased level of human growth hormone, science has documented normal rates of cellular division reoccur. This is important to the cells and to your organs. People with growth hormone deficiency have saggy faces due to the loss of facial fats and muscle tone. With the introduction of higher levels of IGF, it improves the function of the largest organ of the body, your skin. The muscles in your face tighten, and the collagen and elastin in your skin is replenished. Soon the benefits would be apparent to all. As we age, our vision gets progressively worse due to the loss of elasticity in the lens of the eye. HGH has been proven to revitalize the function of focusing, improve vision, and the ability to adapt to changing light conditions. In 333 patients deficient in HGH output, the number of deaths due to cardiovascular disease were significantly higher than those with normal HGH levels. A deficient patient had twice the chance of dying from a heart attack or stroke. Increased levels of HGH has been documented to reduce blood pressure and strengthen the heart muscle itself while reversing pre-existing cellular damage. Growth hormone strengthens bones by stimulating the bone building cells to produce more bone growth. Vitamin D3 becomes more bioavailable and combines with calcium to increase density. HGH can also inhibit the onset of osteoporosis. The FDA has approved synthetic HGH combinations available by doctor's prescription only, which mimic HGH in the body. Natural human growth hormone supplements utilize food-based amino acid combinations to naturally stimulate the body's pituitary gland, allowing it to release its own HGH. There are two ways to increase your human growth hormone level. One is with drugs, and the other way is with natural products that cause your body to secrete its own natural human growth hormone. In the form of drugs, it requires injections. Injections on a regular basis require a professional and cost quite a bit of money, as much as $1,800 a month. Medical science has documented this safe and natural reversal of the effects from growing old there will soon be a chronologically older population enjoying 10 to 20 more years of youthfulness as science has allowed us to discover the fountain of youth within us all.